starting out our longest day and I want to see how the GoPro works. Get some decent footage with the GoPro. Apparently I'm going to be looking at my nose the whole day. That's what it feels like already. But I'm not going to do too much on the on carrying it around. Because I kind of just want to see see how well the recording is. See what kind of pictures it can get. And uh, some of the roadside footage. Because I can hook it to the window. And get some footage. So let's try that. It's gonna be. I found a, a good sized chunk of chaga, and I'm gonna introduce that here in a little bit because I think the rest of this video is gonna be on maybe a few other things, lunch today, and then testing that chaga when I get home. So, yes, I've been super excited about it. I've been waiting to get a piece for a long time. But for 
for some reason, I can sit and listen to motivational speeches. It's got Kobe Bryant and LeBron James and all kinds of other basketball stars. Michael Jordan. And uh, I don't ever want to be a UFC fighter or a race car driver. But I sure as hell can sit and listen to all of these people. It gets me fired up. It gets me motivated. <laughs> ha! stuff and what do you listen to sometimes it's just music for me on the second half of the day I gotta listen to music my YouTube has been weird though and it keeps like recommending Tom McDonald Eminem and Upchurch which is almost like angry music all the time kind of and I don't really want to I don't want to stay angry I like the music but trying to put more inspirational stuff in some of my videos I just gotta figure out how to do it because the the thing about being a motivational thing and, and having motivational speakers on your videos and stuff is like they're not me it's not me doing the motivational speaking I'm not saying I wouldn't I'm just saying it's not me that is doing it so would it be better if I tried to spit out some motivational crap or would it be better to just throw a little uh, motivational stuff in there you let me know All right, so we're going to pick up this last stop and then go to the dump it's the end of the first load
base door. And I'm done. And there's another day in the books. I'm gonna have to get to that chaga in the next video. Yeah, last one. This one's got a range hood sitting out front of it. I'm gonna grab that because I picked up a I picked up a, a dryer today for scrap. So I'm gonna haul that off. So I might as well grab this this range hood. And that's it. It's the end of the day, guys. I'm gonna use this, edit it figure out what the footage looks like and then it'll give me an idea how the GoPro is going to work but 